this point, that's all of you. We are proud of being who we are. Estamos orgullosos de nuestras raíces. De quién somos. And as you know, Belize is composed of different ethnic groups. And here in the north, most people are mestizos. And as you heard this morning, I, um, I am a probably a mestizo and I do understand the Maya language up to a 90%. So, I, along here I have persons who do understand and they can speak the Maya language. And we are proud to be mestizos. Are we proud of being a mestizo? And because we are proud, we will be, our school will be doing a presentation of a dance, a mestizo dance. So let's hear it for you ready. Que viva los mestizos! Okay, ready? Ready children? Ready, ready? Do any of you would like to try it? Ms. Carrillo? Ms. Carrillo is willing. Do, do you want Ms. Carrillo to try it? Next time, next time she says, okay? Okay, you see, boys and girls, invited guests, parents, we have talent. Tenemos talento en nuestros niños. We have talent in our children. So with this, we have talents in, in all aspects, in all different skills. Some children can dance, as we, we heard Iseni giving and delivering a nice speech. There are other people. For this, I think that education is very important for our society. My beloved people, as everything has a beginning, it has an end. And I would like to stay more here, but I know that the sun is hot. I'm good over there here because there is shade. But we need to end the program. And now I am honored to call on our assistant local manager to give you some words of appreciation. Let's hear it from Mr. Luna. Well, I must comment on that dance. And I want to share with you that I have tried that and have not been successful. <laughs> so I want to congratulate the child and I want to thank her for entertaining us before I thank anyone else. Of course, with the help of, uh, with the 
um, permission of our friends from Cleveland State University. Dr. Mark, Richard O'Brien, Reverend T, Honorable Marco, Ms. Carla, Education Officers, members of the Augustine Ridge Committee, Village Council, Church Leaders, Vice Principals, Mr. Oswaldo Castillo, Local Engineer, Parents, Teachers, Students and Friends. It is my privilege to be here among you all. On this historic occasion, an occasion which will remain in our minds for a long time. This is so because so many of, of you people have come from home and abroad to construct one more milestone in the development of this beautiful village of Agaspan Ridge. What was once a dream is about to become a reality. It couldn't have come at a better moment. The present overcrowded conditions in our school and the excess of heat of these days have clearly sent a message to all groups concerned. You all have responded in an amazing, a very amazing manner, and I thank God for guiding you in this direction. I also thank you for being so mindful of our children and of the needs of this community. A million thanks to the group called Engineers Without Borders, who will greatly assist us in the construction of this much needed building. A big thank you to the community who is willing and ready to do what it takes to make this project a re reality. Thanks to the village council, the churches who have also given their help. Thank you to Honorable Representative. Muchas gracias goes to the project committee who has been working and will be working very hard as this project progresses towards its completion. Thank you, thank you, Mrs. Blanca Torres, principal, for all the work that you have done and for all the effort that you will do in the days to come. My most sincere thanks to each and everyone who in one way or another has helped to get this project off the ground. Once more, a very special thank you to Professor Mark and students of Cleveland State University of Ohio, USA. We hope that being here with us will be pleasant and enjoyable. We will always be grateful and thankful to you for being so kind to us. May God bless you, may God bless America, and may God bless Belize. Thank you very much, Mr. Luna, for the thanking. And if in case we skip somebody, we thank you from, from our heart. Now let me hear you, students. Agasman Ridge RC School. Yeah. Engineers without borders. Engineers without borders. Yeah. Okay, um, at this point I think the principal has an announcement. Um, yes, um, I think the children will be happy. We are we have gotten permission from Father Chi. To, for you to be dismissed at this moment, but for you all to come back at one o'clock and we will continue with normal classes. <laughs> okay, so we want to see all of you at one. We are going to have normal classes at one. So, thanks and thanks to Father Chi. <laughs> okay, thank you very much, Teacher Berta. I will ask the children to go in order. I will ask the probably the preschool to move first, to move in order, and I will also ask the assistance of the upper children 
to help the little ones to take their furniture. Yes, at this we can start moving. Thank you very much to all of you. Now, 